So while I've been vacationing in West Virginia, I've seen all these Tudor's Biscuit World. So I'm gonna do a food review, get some breakfast items, let you know how it is. So I got a couple items here. I got the Thundering Herd Biscuit, which is bacon, sausage, cheese, egg, and a hash brown. I also got a platter, which came with an egg made to order, a biscuit, sausage, and then sausage gravy, as well as diced apples, which is weird. Um, the meal with a drink included, I got orange juice, was about eight to $10. Um, so I'm gonna try this and tell you how it is. Biscuit's very good. Nothing special about the sausage. It's Feels like a, actually a sausage patty you would buy from the grocery store. But the outside's a little crusty, soft and flaky on the inside. It's big too. Um, I think it's pretty good. Um, better than McDonald's, if you ask me. And like I said, it's unique. I guess to this area, I don't see any Tudor's Biscuit World anywhere else other than West Virginia. I'm going to try the platter next. So the sausage gravy, pretty good. Um, I, I really like that. That breakfast potatoes nothing special and the um sausage like i said just like the sausage patty the biscuit's good i'm gonna try these apples and see what they're all about so it just tastes like warm apples you find in an apple pie not bad like i said um they have mainly biscuits but they do serve lunch and dinner and this ran me about eight to ten dollars a meal so that's a wrap for this. Uh, so that's a wrap for this. If you're ever in southern West Virginia, check it out. Um, cool little breakfast spot. Uh, unique with the fact that you can get like a platter with eggs however you want. I got eggs over easy. But definitely worth it to try the biscuits.